No authentication portal is convenient for managing temporary wireless access in public places such as restaurants, shopping malls, and airports. It allows clients to access a network without providing any login information, while offering a vivid and customized authentication portal page for business promotion. With this function configured on your controller, clients will be redirected to your preset portal page after they connect to your network and try to access the internet. Step 1. Create a wireless network by setting security to none. Launch your controller and enter the site view. Go to Settings, Wireless Networks. Create a wireless network SSID and set security to none. Apply the settings. Step 2. Create a no authentication portal entry. Go to Settings, Authentication, Portal. Create a portal entry. Enable Portal and choose a new wireless network you created. Set Authentication Type to No Authentication. Set Authentication Timeout to determine how long each client can connect to your network. Clients will be offline after authentication timeout. Enable daily limit. After authentication times out, clients cannot be authenticated again until the next day. If you disable this option, clients can be authenticated again and again without limit. Enable HTTPS redirection. Unauthorized clients will be redirected to the portal page when they are trying to browse HTTPS websites. If you disable this option, unauthorized clients will be unable to browse HTTPS websites nor be redirected. Set landing page to promotional URL and specify your URL. Here we use tplink.com forward slash en as an example. Clients will be redirected to this URL after they pass portal authentication. Step 3. Customize your portal page. In the portal customization section, you can edit the current portal page or import a customized page via HTML or zip file. Here, we will edit the current portal page. Keep default language as English. The controller automatically adjusts the language displayed on the portal page according to each client's system language. If the language is not supported, the controller will use a default language specified here. Change the background picture to a picture you prepared. You can preview the result on the right side of the page. Place the logo to your own and adjust the logo size and position. If you don't want to show any logo, just disable it. Change the button color, button text, and text color as you like. Adjust the button position. You can configure welcome information, terms of service, and or copyright for clients if needed. Text content, size, and color are customizable. Enable Show Redirection Countdown after authorized if needed. Clients will see a countdown for redirection after a successful portal authentication. Configure advertisement options if you want. You can upload advertisement pictures to display on the authentication page before the login page appears.
set the advertisement duration. For this duration, the pictures will be displayed in a loop. Set the carousel interval. Each uploaded picture will be displayed for the specified interval within the advertisement duration. You can check the box to allow users to skip the advertisement. Apply the settings. Connect a smartphone or laptop to the wireless network with the portal configured. The portal page will come out with advertisement pictures. You can skip the advertisement and start authentication. 